Hi, Paul Yakovich here, Director of Facility Operations, and it's time for another operations uh, update. Uh, before I get into our topic for uh, the update this time, I want to extend a, my appreciation and thanks to all the residents who I've gotten positive feedback from uh, from our previous uh, operation updates. Um, it's good to know that we're reaching out and uh, providing some positive, some good information that uh, makes a difference out there in your day to day. Um, the operations update this time will be talking about comings and goings and um, also away checks, exactly what we do uh, during away check in an apartment. But before I get into that, um, I'll never miss the opportunity to um, bring to your attention all the information that we provide during these updates are in the resident manual. Um, every aspect of the operational uh, functions that we do here are contained uh, in the resident manual along with a, a whole lot of other information regarding uh, your lifestyle and all the things that are available to you at Shell Point. So I always strongly, strongly recommend that you, you know, keep one of these at your bedside um, and do some midnight reading. Um, all good information in there. So as I mentioned, I want to talk about comings and goings. Uh, comings and goings is a, a service that we provide here at Shell Point for residents who uh, either go for a short stay or a prolonged stay. It may be for just a matter of uh, a few nights that they're away or even uh, you know, several weeks and in some cases several months. The, uh, so if you have a, any kind of planned overnight stay, you know, please uh, take advantage of the service that we order with a coming and going because it's all to your advantage. It does several things. Um, you can pick up the comings and goings form um, at any one of the service desks or you can submit a coming and going online uh, via www.shellpoint.net. Um, when in thinking about submitting a coming and going, please keep in mind that to give us several days um, advance notice, because it will take at least a day for the information to get to the call center, and then another day for us to notify all the appropriate uh, departments that are affected by your comings and goings. Um, you can, uh, after you fill out a form, you can submit it, uh, drop it off with your court rep, drop it in inner office mail, or you may notice at the island gate we have a convenient mailbox for you. They'll take them up at the uh, Woodlands gate as well and security will forward that information to us so we get into the system. One of the important aspects that we need to know is if you're part of the morning assurance program. Um, so um, we can let those volunteers know that um, if uh, they make the assur morning assurance call um, the fact that um, everything is okay there because you're away and we have advanced notice on that. Other information that needs to be provided obviously is your name and your apartment and the uh, dates that uh, you're going to be away. Uh, a very important piece of information to include is an emergency contact or the contact information that you have if it's any different that we have on file for you so we can get a hold of you in case something comes up while you're away. Now, concerning your apartment or wherever that issue may be. Um, there's another aspect that uh, we consider is if you want to continue the housekeeping service while you're away. You have that option to cancel it or keep it. And then any other information that may be um, uh, of interest to us. Uh, it may be about your pet or any other significant um, individual issue that you have in your apartment. Okay, our way checks and exactly what does that entail? Um, even if, again, if it's only for a matter of a few nights, um, keep in mind that uh, um, the, the whole the safety of your apartment and the condition of your apartment and all those things that possibly can go wrong, uh, we're in there, we want to check. The, um, uh, and all that information, again, is included in the, the resident manual. But um, an away check will be done either by maintenance or our property management team uh, to make sure that the uh, uh, thermostat is set properly at a proper uh, setting at 76 degrees. Uh, and we do this because there's a great potential, a large potential of uh, mold and mildew development if the thermostat is set incorrectly. Another thing that we check in conjunction with that is to make sure that all the windows are closed and secured, the sliding glass doors are closed and secured, because the incorrect thermostat setting 
um, and uh, the high humid air that we have here in uh, Florida is a perfect recipe for the development of mold and mildew within your department. The other things that we're going to do is to check make sure all your lights are uh, out and that all the appliances are um, properly secured, that nobody's left uh, an oven on or whatever that may be. And again, for prolonged absences, now, around two to three weeks, we're going to go in and we'll turn off the water in your apartment. Now, one of the major issues that we have here, uh, through no fault of residents, for instance, it would be a failure of a fluid master. The fluid master is the device in everybody's toilet that regulates the water level in the bowl. Um, all it takes is a failure of one of those where it keeps on running and the water runs over and it being unchecked over a long period of time, you can imagine that the damage it can do to your floors, your furniture, and if you live in an upper apartment, um, the damage that it can do on the apartments below. Um, so those are the main things that we want to check. Um, our away checks are done, again, weekly. Um, and if we go into your apartment to do an away check, we're going to leave you a, a, a small card and it lets you know that we were there, the dates were there, and that everything was okay. Um, a lot of people are sometimes reluctant about, okay, um, letting anybody in their apartment while they're away. Uh, it's always been a matter of pride uh, in the departments that I have, um, maintenance and uh, housekeeping in particular, that we are very, very aware that this is your home. And this is a service that we want to provide to secure your home and give you that peace of mind while you're away that somebody's watching it. Uh, you may have left a key with a neighbor to do that, but it's our staff that know what to look for specifically in regard to you know, how an appliance is secured, um, you know, to check the toilets, to look up the ceilings to see if there's any kind of, it's a, if, if there's any kind of uh, humidity in the apartment, to look uh, for the development of mold and mildew. Whatever the situa situation may be, you know, our staff is trained to look and check that. And in closing, once again, I want to remind you all this information is in the resident manual and I strongly encourage you, if you have any questions about the away checks or comings and goings, to uh, contact your property manager. That would either be Tony Reyes or uh, Kevin May or uh, whenever in doubt about anything, one call does it all, you can call 2190. Thank you and uh, have a great day.